Uh, I am Virginia Gindiru, a director of programs at Zizi Africa. And within this unit is where we run most of the uh, foundation innovations. I uh, support and lead uh, most of the program design work and uh, the implementation phase. And looking, just looking into the insights of what is emerging, especially on matters children's learning. So my village was uh, uh, an initiative that sought to target communities that are struggling or lagging behind in terms of their literacy foundational uh, outcomes. And uh, we had uh, three counties, the county of Bungoma. And Bungoma has always been that one county where uh, you know, learning, learning is not happening as it should, uh, despite it being very different from what we otherwise know as the arid, semi-arid lands. So it is in the interest of just wanting to understand the dynamics uh, and explore pathways or innovative ways in which learning support could happen. We also had uh, Kilifi, and Kilifi among the coastal regions is one of the areas that's really recording low outcomes. Uh, and then we equally had a team working with those communities uh, to facilitate learning support uh, for children. Kitui, uh, which is also uh, in, 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 in one of the dry counties of this country, is uh, another area we looked into. And I must say that each of these uh, spaces was unique in its own way, but also presented unique challenges in terms of learning. And one can equally now appreciate why, despite all the investments, despite all the work that's going into this, these challenges still persist. And we thought through my village, uh, we could explore the place of youth uh, champions in facilitating that change. And it doesn't hurt for uh, youth to step up and say, we would want to be part of the story, of the life-changing stories from our communities by supporting and volunteering our time to support learning. So that was the inspiration behind my village. Yeah. So uh, based on these findings, uh, uh, it emerged that there was need for action. And this action needed to be led and championed. So we have uh, transitioned into a phase of uh, looking at how PAL network members in the different countries come up with solutions tried and tested uh, to address this challenge of low foundational learning outcomes. And so my village is one part, and the uh, essence of it is uh, to work around a community-based intervention that is uh, supporting and facilitating learning by activating both the households learning at home and activating the learning support infrastructure for these children. It is implemented in three countries, uh, Nepal, uh, Kenya, and Tanzania uh, by three members of the PAL network. In Kenya, we implemented it in three counties, counties of Kitui, Kilifi, and Bungoma, and in each of these counties, because we are talking about community-driven change, community-led change, we had three partners. Uh, in Bungoma, we had Milimo CBO, uh, who supported the implementation, the mobilization of youths, and the management of the day-to-day -day running of the intervention. In Kilifi, we were supported by uh, a partner called Kilifi Youth uh, Empowerment Group, KYEG, and they also led and oversaw all the engagements related to the project. And in Kitui, uh, we had uh, a partner called uh, uh, Carlo. Uh, I'm lost. You are lost yeah.